Since the 2009 launch of the IDN fast track process, ICANN has received 33 requests for IDNs covering 22 different language scripts. 14 have been delegated and more will be soon. The 22 include Arabic, Chinese, and Cyrillic scripts, together used by 1.5 billion people worldwide. Some want to bring internet governance into the framework of intergovernmental organizations exclusively. What would that mean? Most internet users, businesses, service providers, nonprofits, and consumers would be shut out of the governance debate. Make no mistake, if we do not address this now, effectively, together, the multi-stakeholder model that has enabled so many successes will slip from our grasp. We must work in partnership to continue the innovation and op openness that are the hallmarks of this multi-stakeholder model. The IGF is an important public forum where all interested parties can come together equally to address these issues for the common good. Its greatest values are its egalitarian philosophy and inclusiveness. Here, the doors are open. The IGF derives its strength and legitimacy from its multi-stakeholder composition. Bringing it into a traditional intergovernmental framework would undermine what the UN itself has been pursuing in recent years, private and public community partnerships. All stakeholders must make their views known to their respective governments. It is governments alone that will decide the future of this body at the UN General Assembly this fall in New York. In conclusion, each of us can call on the UN to retain this successful IGF format that is so valuable. But what matters most is that we further strengthen the multi-stakeholder model by continuing to welcome diverse and occasionally contradictory voices. Together we can ensure that the Internet's future rests in the hands of its most important constituency, the people. The Internet works. Let's keep it that way. Thank you.